MEPs have called on Western diplomats to step up sanctions against Russian energy companies as the US, the EU, Russia and Ukraine are meeting in Geneva to find a diplomatic solution to the Ukrainian crisis. With 437 votes in favor, 49 against and 85 abstentions, the European Parliament approved a set of targeted measures against Russia and urged Moscow to withdraw its troops from eastern Ukraine. Sanctions have a sense if they have the role of deterrence. And therefore, I think we cannot wait too long uh, if the development goes on as it does at the moment. And I think after this was not done in, on Monday, that the final judgment about that has to be taken tomorrow. Condemning Russia's escalating destabilization in the area, the parliament also welcomed the measures adopted by the commission that would enable Ukraine to tackle an energy crisis if Russia decides to cut gas supplies. The vote comes after a violent clash left three people dead and 13 injured in eastern Ukraine, where pro-Russian separatists, allegedly backed by Russian military forces, seized government buildings over the weekend. The issue of critical importance is energy security. The letter by President Putin to 18 member states and five partner countries illustrates well just how important this issue is. The European Union will respond jointly to the letter in order to agree on consultations with Russia and Ukraine with a view to ensuring security of supply and transit. With Russian troops gathered on the border with Ukraine, Russia's President Vladimir Putin said he has the right to send troops into Ukraine, but hopes he will not have to.